Hi, this is Daniel DeTuro. Are you concerned about the risks of naturally occurring plant toxins affecting your health? In this video, I'll share toxic plant and animal foods, natural plant food toxins, domesticated animal food toxins, natural versus synthetic pesticides, and toxins and modern living. Several viewers have commented that animal foods are healthy and all plant foods are toxic. Over the millennia, animals and humans have learned which foods are safe to eat and which were unsafe. Today, most processed animal and plant foods have natural and synthetic toxins. Some plants produce natural pesticides. Plants like poisonous mushrooms can cause serious illness or death. Others have mild toxins that allow them to mature and reproduce. Plants that cannot reproduce will go extinct. That means less vegetation for plant-eating animals. When an animal's food supply disappears, that animal also dies out. Insects can develop resistance to a plant's toxins. That's one reason farmers use synthetic pesticides to increase yields. Natural plant food toxins include lectins, cyanogenic glycosides, glycoalkaloids, muscarine, and mycotoxins. Of all the plant toxins, most people fear lectins in beans and nuts. An American doctor turned nutrition specialist has linked lectins to a variety of chronic diseases and obesity. He claims unless pressure cooked, conventional cooking does not inactivate water-soluble lectins. Although lectins have not been linked to any serious illness, there are a variety of unproven anti-lectin dietary supplements. There's no proof these plant-based supplements reduced claim health risk from lectins in raw and cooked foods. Most animal foods are made from domesticated animals. Most city dwellers do not eat wild game. Cattle, pigs, sheep, and poultry are all plant eaters. Most are fed crops grown for animal consumption. Those crops have natural and synthetic toxins. Eating a strict animal food diet does not protect you from plant toxins. That's why most fad diets recommend eating only organic grass-fed beef and organic pork and poultry. Even eating a 100% organic animal food diet does not eliminate natural plant toxins. Before synthetic pesticides, natural pesticides included arsenic, mercury, nicotine, and lead. Human and animal food crops are sprayed with a variety of synthetic pesticides. The food industry claims they're safe when applied as directed. Popular, highly processed protein powders have been found to contain high levels of toxic heavy metals. Many people eat diets high in prepared foods with added chemicals. Non-organic prepared foods have preservatives to inhibit the growth of harmful toxins. Processed meats have added nitrites and nitrates. The food industry claims they're safe. Others say they are not. In general, any harmful side effects increases with the amount of consumed toxins. Toxic chemicals are a part of modern living. It's ironic people claiming all plant foods are toxic to humans Ignore hundreds of everyday, non-dietary sources of toxins. Millions of people breathe toxic air, drink toxic water. Chemicals in plastic bottles 
can leach into purified water and other beverages. People buy and use toxic cleaners, spray their homes and yards with toxic pesticides. Mining operations release airborne toxins and contaminate groundwater. People drink toxic beverages and eat foods in toxic packaging. People use poorly tested synthetic cosmetics and other personal care items. Many have toxic addictions. Why condemn plant food toxins and ignore other sources of toxins? Is it due to mounting evidence people eating high plant food diets live longer, healthier lives? And people are eating more plant foods and less animal foods. Perhaps the toxic plant food hysteria is just a way to promote and protect the $350 billion animal food industry. Please leave a comment if you have any questions about this video. Thank you for watching and healthy eating.